Hi everyone. In this video, I'm going to show you how to make your very own beverage belly boat. What's a belly boat, you ask? Here. This is a belly boat. Great way to fish. Unfortunately, I don't have a place to put my beverage. Now, before I begin, I just want to be clear about one thing. This video is not about boozing and boating. However, when you are out on the lake and it's a hot day, it's nice to have your beverage kept safe and not spilled. So a beverage belly boat will keep it close to you, whether you're fishing from a belly boat or maybe floating around an air mattress or whatever. It keeps your drink with you. So to make this, all these parts are from a local hardware store. It's easy to get stuff. Um, the cup holder itself is made from a piece of three inch ABS plastic pipe, which is called a uh, coupler. And then there's also this piece here that's called an end cap, and that'll be going together with the coupler to make the cup holder at the end of all this. And then the next thing I have is a stainless steel hose clamp. That's a three inch stainless steel hose clamp. Um, we'll use a couple little pieces of Velcro and a bit of weather stripping. I also have a hook. This will hook it onto your belly boat or your air mattress. Or right, we need uh, cement to glue the ABS together. Don't forget that. You should probably wear some gloves to protect yourself from this stuff. It's kind of hard on the skin. This is an inner tube that came from a uh, garden cart. Those little things you can pull stuff around your yard with. It's a four inch inner tube and it will be the flotation device for our belly boat. You only need a couple of tools for this build. All you need is a flat bladed screwdriver and a drill. I'm gonna glue these two pieces together and that will make our cup holder with a little bit of this cement. It's pretty wicked stuff actually. There we are. Get a nice big glove. Ew. Okay, and we put this all around the edge. And this stuff actually doesn't glue, it melts the plastic and then bonds it together um, like a weld. That's just like welding. And it makes an extremely strong connection. So we just press that down a bit. And that should do it. We're all together. Wipe off a little extra crud here. There. Nice. So the next thing I'm going to do is drill a hole in the side of the cup holder. And this is where our valve stem will go through. Then I'm going to open up this hose clamp and put the lanyard on it. So this is what will keep us secure. So I'm just going to slip the lanyard on there and do it back up. Now we need to clamp this down to the cup holder. <clears throat> now be sure you don't cover the hole we just made and you will need to slip the velcro pieces in behind this. Space, space the velcro pieces out on the opposite side from the hole you made. So they will hold the inner tube on the far side while the hole will hold it on the near side. And then tighten the clamp down, make it all secure. And there we are, we've now got our Velcro and our lanyard mounted to the cup holder. So now, we've got our inner tube. We'll take that, put the valve stem through the little hole, and then put it over top, make sure the Velcro comes up the inside. Put it completely over, pull your velcro up straight, and there we have it, all ready for inflation. So now, I just take the cap off the valve stem here, and grab my air hose, and put some air into this. Now you don't need a lot of pressure in here, because you can blow this thing up like a balloon, it would be huge, That'd be, that would be too much. Just like that, we just want this to float. So now that I've got that done, I simply take my Velcro and put it tight around either side. One last detail, I've got a couple little pieces of weather stripping. I'm just going to stick them down in the bottom and that will prevent rattling when you have a can or something of that nature inside there. And you can see it's got a little padding down at the bottom now. And there we have it. It is now a complete beverage belly boat ready to go. So let's go try it out. Ah. 
All right. Now I'm good. Hope you enjoyed the video. I'm going fishing.